Rather delicious! Oh, delicious! What a wonderful adjective to use! <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Would you... Would you, um... Would you care to... to uh, it's high tea time, and I do believe that we have time for high tea. <laughs> we do! Okay. The, the, the problem I foresee, sir, is that someone's in that large base over there. Ah, oh, I can see how that would be a problem. I, I think we need to find a place to have our tea and crumpets. Someone's definitely running around. Indeed! Where do you suggest, good sir? Two seconds. Let me, uh, check my map. Uh, indeed, that is, that is a map that you're holding. Uh, I suggest this way. Ah, uh, uh, yes! Then my travels led me to Afghanistan, where I <laughs> fought in the war. Those were some quite interesting stories. I saw my comrades die in front of me, but many of them did make it, and for that, I congratulate all of them. Such fine gentlemen to be enlisted with. However, as it turns out, it was time to come home. I came home to America. And man, that was a trip. What I happened in America? Have everyone just yell at me. Everyone just yelled at me! As Americans do, they tend to do this thing called yelling. <laughs> and that is actually the way they do any sort of discourse. In fact, I was trying to talk the other day to a woman at the coffee shop. I said, Lady, I didn't order coffee. I actually ordered green tea. And she gave me a green tea latte. And I was like, Lady. And I politely asked her to, that this wasn't my drink order. And she said, Bitch, please! What the fuck you think this is? And I'm, I was confused because I, I, was, I was thinking it was Starbucks. Fuck. <laughs> You've been on some adventures, wow! My, mine... I went to Asia in my travels after becoming the CEO of a major company. Don't ask how that happened, it just did. You, sir, are one fine fellow. Fuck. Compared to your adventures, my, mine fail in comparison. Oh, don't say that, old chum! Guarantee everyone's story means something. After all, we have the time with the tea, do we not? We do. do we... Wait, do we have any meat to cook? Oh, so, yes. a good old American pastime: cooking meat, <laughs> eating oh, said good, meat. It's no wonder why we're so obese. What? What do you mean? You don't look that obese to me. Ah, yes, but that's because I keep myself in peak form. Also, I lived in Asia, where the diet is quite rigorous. Hmm. Did you like the Asian food? Yeah. I love Asian food. I especially like the curry. It's me. Those Thai oh, people yeah. make some mean curry. Yes. Penny. The Mexicans of the Chinese, uh, that's what they call them. Me? Oh, hey, mate. That is amazing. You, sir, I believe, are one of the most interesting fellows I have met in Rust yet. To date! Oh, yes. What's the doing? All the things must like come rushed. to an end, and that is why I am here, yeah, naked. Like... I must shower you with gifts. Oh, oh thank you! What a... What a gentleman! A hazmat boot a... You shouldn't have, good sir. I guarantee I will repay your kindness one day. A thousand stones, jeez. The gift's for you, sir, for being such a good fellow. This is 
Ah, uh, I should reward you later. When I get my business back from the gooks, I will definitely come back to you. <laughs> you are amazing. Um, I am Dick Savagewood. If ever I come across you again, sir, shall we go kill someone for our and eat him? I think we should eat someone. Cannibalism. Eat someone? Mm -hmm. You know what? I, I never thought of it that way, but you know, I, I'm feeling adventurous with my appetite, so okay. I don't see why not. Right, let's go locate someone and then eat him for to celebrate our new friendship. That's what we do. Now and then, I'm just going to drop some stuff off at the base and we'll continue our, our feast for cannibalism. Indeed. This is where I live on this rock. There's a guy ah, outside. Indeed, what a lovely. Rock. The cannibalism begins, sir. Come here, we want to eat you. I mean, friends, friendly. Friendly, sir, friendly. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I have bags of his feet. Uh, it's a Bobby Six Killer. Oh, the irony. We That's just blast funny. him. Believe it, he has so much stone! Oh, 179 to be exact. That's a hatchet. Ah, uh, yes, yeah. scrumptious meal, a delicacy in the Mongolian. Got it. Oh, let's build a campfire and eat his skull. That's delicious! I, I've always wondered what a human skull tastes like. <laughs> But there are campfires here, but... Oh, perfect! So we eat it together, sir? Indeed! We're gonna eat human meat together. Anyway, your cannibalism meat's done, sir. Let's, let's eat meat to friendship. We're eating this person, leave us alone. We got your pizza, sir, or should I help I do. I have one for me, sir. Let's eat them together. You ready? On the count of three. Oh, what? Excellent. One, two, three. Oh, to cannibalism and friendship. Good cheers. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> what a scrumptious meal. Mmm. Oh, you have two. You like it that much? <laughs> oh, mmm. That's delicious. Mm. Oh, I got a little bit of his hair. <laughs> That's unfortunate. But still, overall great meal. Mmm. <laughs> That was good. To friendship! Our journey has ended. Has our journey ended? I feel like it's just because... <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me drop some more stuff off and we'll go eat some more people. How about that? I love this! This is just a good pastime to have. I'll tell my yes, friends all about it. 